So today I just kind of want to talk about why I quit Season of Discovery. Um, it's not because I don't think Season of Discovery isn't good. I think it's pretty great, actually. Um, I've had a lot of fun for SOD, and I, I honestly wish it was forever, but sadly it's not. Uh, Season of Discovery isn't permanent. Essentially, it's going to get scrapped, uh, <laughs> as far as I'm concerned. They've already confirmed Classic Plus, so most likely SOD will get scrapped in the future. And it just kind of feels like I'm wasting my time putting in effort, and that's that's honestly the main reason. Um, another really big reason is I just I just wasn't having fun. I pretty much did everything I could to try and make money, get all the gear I could. Um, like an example would be like getting exalted with AV and getting max rank PvP gear, um, doing my lieutenant commander so that I could get the uh, lieutenant commander helmet there. And getting the two set um, since I didn't have you know all the tier gear um, <laughs> and honestly as well as getting every single map for uh, Sulphuros having all of my gear enchanted extra enchants for for gear when I get the gear that I need yada yada uh, but yeah another another big reason or aside from SOD not being permanent, just uh, wasn't having fun with my guild anymore, and nothing against them, they're a great guild, it just feels like things went from being really fun, and everybody laughing and enjoying themselves, to like raid being a really tense situation, um, for me it felt like everybody used to be like laughing and having fun, and then, you know, eventually people would just get kind of lazy, um, honestly in Molten Core we died to the second boss, almost every single raid, probably honestly every single raid, um, and we'd all just lose our world debuffs, and that was like a huge downer. Um, just because someone couldn't dispel the tank, or the tank wouldn't use their free action potion, and then we just wipe. And then the rest of MC would take forever to complete, and along with people just being lazy, and, eh, you know. Um, <laughs> and... and it sometimes doesn't feel like people put in like the minimum amount of effort and then the raid leader would get all super serious and angry and also the loot distribution was just terrible and um yeah honestly with me showing up every week full debuffs consumables going out of my way to get you know different gear pvp gear just so i could do more damage um <laughs> Uh, there'd be multiple weeks where I wouldn't get a single piece of gear. You know, I might get an off-spec piece of gear or an off piece of gear that I didn't need, you know, like, uh, or like these, those wrist guards, which, you know, they're all right. The, these are really good, but like, if you're trying to do heat level three, these, you don't need these cause you have to get the, the devil core set, um, you know, which I didn't even end up getting. So it doesn't really matter, but, uh, <laughs> you know, honestly, but being, going every single week after week after week i only i still only have a four set bonus and there'd be you know there'd be multiple hunters in my guild that already had an they'd have a full eight piece they didn't just have a six piece that they needed for their tier set they'd have a full eight piece and i'd still have <laughs> only my four set and uh you know that 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 uh that kind of pisses me off like they don't they don't need an eight piece sure their eight pieces are best in slot but is that really more important than me having my six piece, like, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, and on top of that, I just, I really just didn't feel like anybody really wanted me there considering the fact that, you know, I made YouTube videos. I feel like people didn't want to interact with me as much anymore. Um, maybe because they didn't want to be in a YouTube video. And also with most of the time, like I would, you know, say something or make this su suggestion and I would just feel ignored. Like, as an example, every single week I would tell the rogues that they didn't need a stand with the paladins in the melee range because they would get, you know, uh, they, there's the mechanic if you had mana that you would get, you get uh, launched across a room. And I told told the rogues, you know, you don't need a stand next to us, you're going to get launched. But every single week they'd still stand there, so, you know, whatever. <laughs> They just make the fight so much more, it's just so much harder, so much more harder than it needed to be, and it didn't need to be that hard. And you know, even with all these issues with like gear and that kind of stuff, I'd bring that up to the the leaders, and I'd either get ignored or just 
be told, you know, that it is the way it is. Um, and then you know, honestly, at that moment, I just realized, you know, that it's, it's, it's not for me, all this intensity and hard work put in and we're just still barely skimming by trying to clear molten core. It's just, you know, uh, <laughs> I honestly consider molten core to be, uh, probably one of the easiest raids in the game. And, uh, <laughs> For it to be this challenging for us is, is just, I, I just feel like I'm wasting my time. Um, yeah, also, you know, I have a family and I enjoy spending time with them and I have hobbies with them too. And on top of that, I just bought a new house. I'm kind of be getting everything here in order as well. Um, but yeah, you know, at the end of the day, I think uh, Season Discovery is great. Um, and being a WoW player and trying to find a good guild that you blend with really well can be very challenging. And trying to hop between guilds is, is honestly very draining. And it can take a lot from, from somebody, depending on what kind of person you are. And, you know, just, just with all that, at the end of the day, it just, it just didn't feel like it was worth it for me. When I could just, you know, hop on retail and just join LFR, have fun, and not be too serious about it. And... Yeah, those are kind of my feelings. But not that I, yeah, not again. Not that I don't think season discovery is great, but just the fact that you know it's 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 all going to be gone. I think I think the things that they've added, especially like the custom quests and different things for you know classes and the changes that they've made to the raids to make them more challenging, more fun and entertaining, have been really great. Um. Yeah, it's mostly just been, like, feeling like I'm wasting my time and that it's not, you know, going to be around for forever, so I might as well just play retail. And, uh, you know, I don't really have to rely on anybody else to be able to do any content. I can just enjoy myself, do what I want to do, and hop out. I don't have to make any commitments to anything and feel like I'm not showing up or, you know, doing my part for, for my team, where that... That's what really, you know, is important to me is, you know, the community and the people I'm around. I want to be, you know, performing my best and doing my best. And, you know, not everybody has that mentality, which is fine, you know, <clears throat> but you just want to be there to have fun. And that's the fun part to me. And, you know, everybody else has their different definitions of fun and what they like to do in the game. That's, uh, that's you know, <laughs> with less than 30% of World of Warcraft's actual population being, you know, actual raiders, yeah, I'm still kind of, kind of clueless on what people actually do in the game. It's just running around doing, doing different things, I guess. But yeah, those are kind of my thoughts, my feelings on the whole situation. Um, you know, season discovery is still, still probably going to be gone for another year. I bet with, uh, you know, they just released Blackwing Lair. They still have AQ40, 20, um, Nax, what else is there? As yeah, Grub is out right now. Um, I guess I don't have the different ones on here anymore. Uh, I'm pretty sure at AQ and then Nax. Um, they're saying they probably come out with some different stuff, so maybe they'll come out with a whole new raid. Like uh, I think people are saying that like the Carriers and Crypts might be coming a new raid as well. Or they'll probably make it a dungeon. Most likely, I would, uh, I'd bet. But, yeah. Still a great game. I don't know what to do with, uh, all this stuff. Maybe I'll just sell all my Arcanite bars, but I most likely don't plan on, uh, coming into the game anymore to play. Um. <laughs> I guess I don't really have much else to say. Um, probably just continue playing, uh, retail for now. Maybe when Classic Plus comes out again, I'll give it another try, but pretty burnt out on putting uh, all my my time and effort into Classic, because it does take a long time, even with the uh, experience buffs that you get in uh, Season of Discovery Classic. There's no way I'm going back to regular Classic with the, the regular leveling experience. That took ages, and back in the day when they re-released Classic, uh, even though I was living a mage and it was really fast, like spending all my time doing that and not putting any effort into anything else in my life. Um, so I lost, you know, relationships and different things that weren't important to me during those periods where, you know, at the end of the day, it probably wasn't meant to be, honestly. But, uh, 
you know, those were different reasons for things, well, I guess, failing in my life. Um, you know, things, uh, things happen for a reason. And, uh, you know, there's some things that are inevitable and unavoidable in your life. And you just got to roll with the punches. Keep going. And, uh, you know, honestly, the most important thing is just enjoying yourself. If you're not enjoying yourself, you got to get yourself out of that situation. And essentially, that's just what I had to do. And it's worked out. I'm still having fun. I bought a little uh, Drift RC. We've got a really cool Drift RC course in my town here that we visit. And a lot of my friends actually go to and they run. And that's been a lot of, a lot of fun, especially, like, working on it. Uh, aside from just, you know, drifting it around, you get to work on it, change things on it, kind of adjust things and try to make it better. And, you know, competing with different people with your Drift RC, it's uh, it's pretty cool. But I've got a lot of other things I need to do with my house on top of that. Um, got to prepare for winter, getting my house winterized there. And uh, just making sure everything's good. Yeah. Appreciate you guys watching. Um, if you guys have comments or feedback, leave it down in the comments below if I helped you in any way or anything like that. Or if you'd just like to chat, you know, maybe about your life or you need advice about different things, you know, feel free to hit me up. But yeah, hope you guys have a good rest of your day. We'll see you.